Wait, wait, wait. Am I hearing right? Did y'all get a dog? Now, you know dogs is just the white man's way of replacing slaves, right? Like, oh, we, we can't own black people no more, so we'll just have Lassie pick the cop. You ever see how Benji be shucking and jiving? You know it's no accident. What do they call their dogs when they ask for them, huh? They say, come here, boy. Hmm? Hmm? See, that's why you gonna be stuck overseeing Toby Jr. forever, and you? You look like you took more hits than Snoop on 420. Can you sit near us and secretly film our conversation with my boss so that I could sue him for sexual harassment? Just do any favor. No. Oh, I'm trying to get another brother caught up. I'm trying to get him into the system? I'm not about that. I'm not about bringing brothers down. That's how they got Cat Williams. <laughs> no, whoa, 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 what are you doing back? Look, I told you to go home and stay home. I gotta work. I gotta make a living too, boss man. <coughs> Wait, Future is the new boss? Uh, because I, I can't pray five times a day. I mean, I don't even know which way is Mecca. Which way is Mecca? <laughs> look, I didn't say I was the boss yet, okay? We're working on it. Baby steps, okay, all right? Baby steps. And look, it's to the east. Remember, I yeah, told you this. Well, duh, but which way is the east? <laughs> to me, thank you so much. I still need someone to film us. Oh. I'm not gonna be in that. Mm -mm. Oh, for you. I just caught everything you said on security camera. Just like that white dude from To Catch a Predator. I was in the back. Saw you looking. Thank you so much, Future. I thought you said you didn't want to turn in another brother. Well, I, I didn't at first. I really wrestled with it. But you know, it came down to the fact that he was really disrespecting you, sisters. Mm -hmm. You know, I can't be doing that. I've been listening to a lot of music, Soul Child, lately. I'm with y'all. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> the last time I checked, Surveillance footage didn't capture audio, so it looks like you're out of another jam, and I'm out in the clear. You might have a point. If I wasn't the audiovisual technician that I am, and rigged ours with sound. <coughs> I would like to see you sanitize. We don't even wash our hands here, and I'm not even making your coffee. Don't, hey, hey, I got this. Uh, brother, song, what, what can I get for you? Let me get a mocha, but hold the Black Plague. <laughs> black Plague? Brother, you know that originated in Europe. You know, they used to cohabitate in pig feces. You ain't know. I'm gonna get your mocha, but read a book sometime. Feeling sick, Brooke? The, uh, it is the bird flu season. <coughs> it's always flu season. I've just been eating a lot of dairy lately. <coughs> uh, yeah. You can't tell the customers that we don't wash our hands. We don't wash our hands. But of course, we don't tell the customers that. Come on. Well, who died and made you the shift manager? Oh, that would be Greg. <clears throat> Greg died. See, I know you were in the process of selling out to the Hollywood plantation. <laughs> but while you're on the clock, yes. you need to have an apron. Oh, hmm? OK. Right, you know how I feel so do. Yeah. Hey, Brooke, we overheard some of your Hollywood wannabe power meeting, and it's clear you need our help. Mm -hmm. What? Yeah, mm -hmm. we got notes. Definitely. Oh, you two guys got notes. Look, I'm going to just keep it real with you. You wrote a whack script. Whack? I'm glad you agree. Look, now we can actually help. I understand. Nobody wants to work in this lame-ass coffee shop forever. Hey, I like working here. Carson, you like waiting in line at the DMV. I get a chance to do all my online banking on my phone. The bottom line is, you're doing surface writing. You gotta get deeper. You gotta kill off your protagonist. Kill her off? Yeah. If you don't kill off your characters, especially your protagonist, it's gonna be like any other phony baloney Hollywood fluff piece, like the Matrix sequels. And you need more brothers in your script. I didn't see too many in there. I was a little ashamed. Oh, OK. All mm -hmm. right, so you want me to add more black characters and then kill them? Well, no. I mean, the brothers ain't got to die. No, it's, the same boys in the hood. They come It's OK. Show them more attention. No. No, brother. See, it's not your fault. It's Beyonce's fault. She's got all of these women thinking they independent and running the world. That they can do without us. See, now? The average woman wouldn't know a good black man if he hit her in the face. Figuratively speaking. Please don't listen to none of that ghetto wisdom. If Shorty can't appreciate you, then let her go. It's gonna be plenty other ones down the road as soon as they realize that you was single. Hmm, they gonna play him even harder than she did. I'm telling you, 
Sloan, the man is the leader, okay? You gotta let a woman know who's running the relationship. Because the Honorable Elijah Muhammad, he teaches hey, us hey, that hey, we- Hey, 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 <laughs> ah, Malcolm X. Go on with that, okay? Fine, you don't want my advice? Sure, in a little while, trust me. The next time you get played, brother, don't come knocking on my door. Uh, Sloan, <laughs> brother, I don't know what you're going through, having never been dumped. But you need to get it together, all right? You're scaring off my customers, which means you're scaring off my tips. <laughs> they in love. That's cute. Oh, oh, yep. Eating cookies and stuff. Eat the cookie, girl, yeah? Because that's how it is in the beginning of the relationship. Give it a few months, right? You're going to be coming back from New York trying to get to LAX. And you're going to be like, baby, can you get me from the airport? He's going to be like, no. Get on the flyaway. You're going to be like, no, you got my car. Did you put gas in my car? Do you ever do anything for me? Ever? OK. No. You need to go ahead and just exhale, Angela. Really. Thank you very much. And you, brother, you need to get over this girl. Man, you sounding softer than vanilla ice cream with Drake lyrics sprinkled on top. It just happened. Yesterday. Come on, man. You're living in the past. Me, I'm always looking to the future. Why you think they call me? Future. Hmm? Probably because you're a pretentious little man stuck in a black poet's body. So you depressed? <laughs> so I'm gonna let that slide. This time. You know, my grandmother gave me that name. 